What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Repentance. Guys, today we are going to play a character I have never played before. This will be a brand new experience for me. We're going to play The Keeper. So The Keeper was introduced, I believe, in The Binding of Isaac... Oh, I'm already dead. <laughs> the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Yeah, that's like around the time when I stopped my last series. We played part of Afterbirth, but uh, yeah, we never finished it. So the Keeper is interesting. You can notice that it's health up in the upper left. It's not actual hearts, it's coins. Yeah, the Keeper starts off with triple shot and two health, and its health is coins. Yeah, so you get two hits. It's kind of like the Lost in that regard. The Lost with the Holy Mantle. Uh, so this is going to be another challenging run, especially for a character that I've never played before. There we go. I got my health back. Um, I thought there was a way to get the Keeper to start with the Wooden Nickel. Maybe there's something else I need to do to unlock that. I'm going to have to figure that out. Hmm... Yeah, anyway, the Keeper should start with the Wooden Nickel once we get that unlocked. And the Wooden Nickel has a 50% chance to drop a coin when used in a room. I think it's a single single room charge item. Yeah, I thought we were we had all this stuff unlocked, but apparently we don't. So I got to be like extra super careful on this character. Uh-huh. Uh, so picking up money is one of those things that we're going to do last unless we need the health last thing that we do on the floor so we always have health to go back to so i'll leave that here for now all right let's go fight gemini all right gemini we'll just fight it like we always do oh my goodness except we're dead except we're gonna die now we don't always die to gemini but when we do it's when we play the keeper uh-huh but yeah, we'll fight it like we always do, killing the baby first, and then going for the big daddy. Alright, that's why I wanted to keep that coin out there, just in case, so we didn't have to go to the next floor with only one HP. Uh, I'm pretty sure PJ's does not do anything for us. Oh, it does! And we get flies. Okay, I was, I was wrong. That's good, so we can pick up this coin. Now we don't have to worry about that. Oh, uh, we have one coin, one bomb, two keys. I think we just go to the next floor. Cellar two. Oh boy, I am just getting hit by everything. I'm not even seeing it. Okay, well, that's my fault. Alright, I don't think we'll be using that unless we get a whole bunch of money somewhere. Pretty sure we can use a sacrifice room like normal. Oh, a library. Okay, yeah, two buck touch. We'll take the invincibility book with us. Let's go this way. You die now, you die now. I said die. Any of you fires have a coin? I could use some health. No? Okay. Whoa! Okay, mm-hmm. The triple shot is interesting. Um, it's more damage than the normal shots, but like the tier rate is so slow. Boom, okay, so there's some HP back. Now we have seven bombs, we'll leave that behind. We'll just take the bombs, the free bombs, for touching it. Uh-huh. And... Whoop! Here we go. You die. Awesome. Yeah, so this literally is the very first time I have ever played this character, like I said. Um... It is more difficult. I have seen it played before, so I do know how it works, and I do know, like, what it's supposed to start with. But yeah, personally never played it before. We only have one cent, so there's no point going into the shop. Let's go fight the boss. 
The haunt. We got plenty of bombs for the haunt. The haunt's little haunt. Ghosties. Okay, now we're dead. I thought we were going to be fine. We're not fine. We're the opposite of fine. What does this one do? I can't remember. It dies to a bomb. Oh, that's not good. It just destroyed my, my rock. Does it just make spiders or does it do other things? Okay, I think it just makes spiders. If that's the case, we might be fine. Might be. I got my invincibility book. Didn't need it though. Tears up is good. I don't know how devil deals work on the keeper. I feel like it works the same and we'll lose our health so we don't go for <laughs> devil deals. I don't think we get them for free. So we're probably not going to do that since we only ever have two hearts on this character without like special trinkets or items or whatever. Uh, yeah, I think angel rooms it is. So how'd that do with our tier rate? Did that even do anything? I don't think it really did much, if anything. Okay, well, our health is full. I like where that <laughs> the room entrance is like between the spikes. Be very, very accurate where you go. Uh, I think we're good. I don't think there's anything else. Nothing else for us. All right, catacombs one. Mushrooms. Yeah, so health up items that normally give you another heart container do not work on the keeper as far as I understand it. Though I'm not a keeperologist, this is my first time playing it. I'm pretty sure it does not work that way. Uh, I mean, I guess it's a mom item touch. Not really interested in touching the pills, though. Keys that we need flight for. Uh-huh. Shop. Mmm, we do have a bomb and I'd like this key. So we've been into our item room. I'll pop this chest. We had a key, a coin, and a bomb. Probably should have left that coin on the ground, but I did not. But I probably should have. Yep. Yeah. Explodey spider of explodiness. Yeah, the up path in that previous room definitely feels like secret room territory. Probably gonna go back there and bomb it. Uh-huh. A charge key. We'll leave that there. Yep. Blue Lisa. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, gotta leave the coins. That's gonna be something that I'm gonna have to break that habit of trying to grab coins as soon as I see them grab all the consumables. Okay. Uh, I was considering if I want to go for the mushrooms, but I don't think I want to do that. Mm-hmm. Come here. There we go. Now the key is good. We have the three keys. So we did not explore the entire four. We did find our item room. We found the shop. We only had three cents though. Let's go fight the boss. The wretched. Mm-hmm. Just keep moving when it jumps. Just keep moving. You're fine. If you pretend everything's fine, everything will be just fine. Yeah, that's how that works. You just pretend that things are fine and everything will be fine. Mm-hmm. Yep. Everything's fine. We're good. We're not fighting a giant spider that's trying to stomp on us. It's Everything's cool. See? It's fine. It's dead. All right. So let's kill all these ads. Whoa. And I guess it's another mom item, I guess. 
Do we go explore the rest of the floor? We need to go pick up the money we left behind. Let's go explore the rest of the floor. See what else we got here. Yeah, so another thing I don't know about this character, since it doesn't have red health, does taking damage and losing a coin heart affect your double deal chance? Or a coin HP? I guess not technically a heart. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't know. These are things that we'll find out as we play this character, I suppose. Okay. That spider just went right for me. So lots of money here. Interesting. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then we have the poo, which I assume would refill our health as well. I'm kind of interested in testing that. Here, hit me. I want to go pop that poo real quick and just see, because I don't know. I assume it does. It does. Okay. Uh-huh. Well, we could pop those in the fool out of there, so that's a possibility. We do have the keys. We also have the invincibility book, which would charge up twice. Or, I mean, it would charge up again by the end of the round. Should we do that? All right, got another key. Let's go do the challenge room. We got four keys. I think it's fine. We can warp out if we need to. We have plenty of coins on the floor. We got coins in here if we take damage. Yep. So far, so good. Easy. Nice. Okay, we'll just collect these coins. We'll collect all the coins in the rooms as we pass them, as we leave the floor. 19 cents. What else has got money in it? I think we go up here. Kind of want to blow up these mushrooms a little bit. Okay, wasn't worth. Might have been worth, but it wasn't, unfortunately. So we got those keys that we can't get to. There's a chest up here. It's behind spikes. Yeah, let's see what's in the shop then. Okay. Um... Yeah, I think we'll take this. I'll blow this guy up for maybe a little bit more money. I'm going to save our donation machine for maybe a floor where we need money and we don't have any. There was money in this room. I could blow those guys up for more money, but I think we're just going to leave it as it is. Let's grab this key. This nickel. 15 cents. I think we're good. Uh, super secret could be right here. I'll give it a try. Not that interested. Uh, let's go. All right, catacombs two. I'm kind of interested in popping this red chest. Although it's probably a troll bombs. Nope, spiders. Might as well have been troll bombs. Okay, we keep going. Oh, we are going to get hit here. Yep. Yeah, I should use my invincibility book right there. I will use it here, though. I'm not going to have that happen again and just die. Troll bomb. Aha! Ooh, and we get our health back. Sweet. That works for me. All right, we blew you up. Just some spiders. All right, we keep going here. 
Uh, yeah, technology could be pretty good. I think we will take that. All right, we gotta go down. Uh-huh. And we go this way. <laughs> Those red spiders were trying so hard to get to me, but they were being blocked by the X spider, the triple shot spider. Oh, that's a big... That was a big champion spider in the center there. It's kind of a big champion worm. Uh-huh. Get him. Oh, Arteria is so awful. Okay, we'll leave that. Okay, now we're dead. Now we're dead. That's why we left that coin. No, I was thinking technology was going to be good for us. Well, it is good for us. Oh my goodness, it is. It's not that good. We definitely need some damage up. For killing these things, that's real good, though. Pew! Just one shot him. Oh, that didn't get him? What the heck? Uh, Alright, so we got 19 cents. Let's go into here. Greed, my guy. You're going to give me all sorts of money, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Whoop, whoop. Nice. All right, so we just leave the money there for now. Uh, yeah, we're still looking for the boss room. I don't understand the point of this room. Are they expecting you to go hit the button and then let these guys out of the cage and not shoot them first? I don't really understand. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so now that we have three keys, I'm going to go back and open this room over here. I was going to save our keys, but since we have extra. Hmm. Button. I chose poorly. I get those big jumpy spiders first. Uh-huh. This one? Okay, that's fine. And this one? Stay back. Stay back. They stayed back. Okay. Well, I guess we're good. I could take damage and go into the one heart battle room, I suppose. How would I take damage? I go walk on a spike. Does that affect my double deal chance? Did we already take damage from something? I don't actually know. There's coins that we can refill our health with. Maybe we'll just take damage by these things anyway. Nope, we're good. Sun card. Let's fight the boss, then we'll take damage and then go into the one hard battle room. I think that's how we're gonna handle this. Is Bumbino? We might just die to Bumbino, but we do have the book. Come down here and break this. Okay. Is he taking my money or is he just making that money? I'm not sure where that's coming from. I have my shield on and he's not doing damage to me, so I don't know. I guess maybe he is stealing my money. Okay, well, we survived. <laughs> Angel room. Let's take the damage. Scapular. I don't know if that does anything for this guy. I don't know. We don't have any bombs. We can't get the angel. Okay, so there's still coins on the floor. Let's go ahead and take some damage and then go into the one heart battle room. We'll see what's in there. If it's good, we'll warp out. Whoa, okay, that's right. I don't think that does anything for us. 
I'm gonna grab this and warp out anyway. Oh, it does do. Okay, we do actually get health up. Yo, I thought you couldn't get any more than two hearts on this character. Maybe that's been changed. Well, since we can have more than that, I guess I will continue playing and not warping out. Okay, like I said, I've never played this character before, so I thought I knew what I was talking about. Apparently, I didn't know what I was talking about. Mm-hmm. Arteri is so awful. <laughs> oh, he's hit us again. This guy. I keep trying to get in those extra shots and just getting too close to him. It's not good. Okay, our book's charged. We got a key. We need to go over here. Back. And down. Okay. I think we're in the clear. I want to go get some coins. Whoa. That could have just ended the run right there. We have money down in the shop as well from greed. Um, so now that we have three health, we can go into like cursed rooms, I suppose. Maybe we'll get nine lives or I don't know, something good in there. Or we'll get a button with a troll bomb. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's good, depending on how you look at it. No, no, that I don't think that's good in any way you look at it, now that I think about it. Unless you have the safety scissors, in which case it would be a free bomb. So maybe that's the only way that would be good if you look at it. Uh, <laughs> I almost just killed myself with that spike again, by the way. I think we're get off this floor. I think we're done here. I think we've done just about everything. I mean, I guess I could pop the sun card. The sun. All right, let's go. Would the sun card have been the best way the best card to keep? Does that refill my health? I don't actually know. I didn't think you could get more health from health ups. So apparently lots of things that I thought I knew about the keep are incorrect. We're just going to go ahead and invincible here. This room seems very sketch and my health is very low. Yep. Yep. Give me that damage. We do need some money, though. Uh, sure. That 4.5 volt looks pretty juicy. We're, we'll be back for that. We're going to make that happen. Marked rock here. I don't think I can do anything with that. Yeah, as soon as we get a bomb, we'll bomb our donation machine. What else is alive in here? The spider. Oh, there's also these sacks. Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. Okay, so bomb.
we will bomb both of these things and get that 4.5 volt which should carry us through boss fights we'll leave that money there for now in case we take more damage we can refill our health Um. Uh, yeah we keep going this way i guess More bombs. All right. Well, I guess we can go get that marked rock back here. The only thing is, if that turns into a small rock, we won't be able to take it. Okay, we just get flies. So I guess you get gray flies or blue flies if you're gonna get soul hearts. Is that how that's working? I'm assuming that's how that's working because nothing came out of that rock except for those flies. That's a lucky penny. We'll hold off on taking the lucky penny. Ooh, look at this. I wish I had free keys on the floor. Worms? Yep. Huh. Now I kind of want to explore more and see if I can get free keys. You know what? Let's just go fight the boss. Let's just do that real quick. We have the invincibility book. We have the 4.5 volt. Reap creep. Although with how slow our tier rate is, I don't know if the 4.5 volt will be able to keep up. So we have infinite shield. Oh my goodness. So I did notice that taking damage from the spider did not affect our deal chance. Let's actually use the book here and just see how slow this charges or fast it charges. It's a very slow charge. Uh, tears up and shot speed. Okay, I mean, that's better. Let's see what's in the double. Okay. Oh, we have to pay for it. Right. So you don't give health, you pay for it. Lucky. Let's keep going. We're gonna see if we can get ourselves more keys or if we can get a golden key on this floor. I don't know if that's a thing. Maybe with that special room, you have a higher chance. Maybe not. Maybe it's all just random still. Oh, we have one more key. I think we have extra coins on the floor. Let's go into here. Chariot card could be good. So we will chariot, we'll grab this, and we'll just leave. We can only take one card with us, and I think the full card is probably the one we should take with us. More keys is good. All right. I mean, so far, so good, I think. Oh, you know what? That item is talking about the red heart thing. Um, speaking of red hearts, I don't think we've seen a single red heart. Maybe red hearts and soul hearts all just give you, uh, blue flies. Maybe that's what's going on. Yeah, I don't think I've seen a single red heart on this run. Maybe you don't get them when you play this character. Let's do the challenge room. Yeah, we'll do this. The tower. Oh, I just let him run right into me. That was dumb. Uh-huh. Get him. There it is. 
Okay, well... Pick up the coins in the shop and then I guess we go. Was there anything else in the shop that I wanted? I don't think so. Maybe we could buy the sack. Maybe it's got more keys in it. It's got a key. Small battery charge. I don't think that's very useful for us. A lot of battery charges on this floor. Only one bomb. Do we blow up those skulls and go for some of those golden chests over here? I don't know. Maybe, maybe we'll go for three of them. Magician. That's a pretty good card, too. Oh. Now I kind of want to go for more. <laughs> Ancient recall. What do we got Ancient here? Recall. Two of diamonds. Hierophant. Yeah, Hierophant just gives us flies. Death. Fool. And magician, huh? Okay, let's hold on to the two of diamonds for a moment. I said I was going to open up two of those. I lied. We're gonna, or three of those. We're going to open up two more. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. We're gonna open them all. Give me that flat penny. Aha, uh -huh, another one, huh? Justice. Justice. That's a troll bomb. Okay, so twenty-nine cents. Now we can two of diamonds. Two of diamonds. Cool. What was this one? Justice. We got lots of bombs. I feel like maybe blowing up so many skulls makes sense too. Two of spades. Duplicate your keys. Well, don't mind if I do, actually. Two of spades. This room actually turned out to be pretty profitable. I like it. I think we can blow through all five of these with one bomb there. Okay, well, let's take our fool card. Was there anything else on this floor that we needed keys for or anything? I don't think so. Yep, I think we go. All right, depths two. Gluttony, huh? Not interested in your pill, gluttony. You keep that. More keys, whoa. Right. Screamy babies of screaminess. Alright, gotta get rid of these guys, these guts. Are brains? Are those brains or guts? I think they're guts. I'm not actually sure. The things. They're definitely things. Um, yeah, we'll do this. So one key and one bomb to open up both of these. Or no, two keys, one bomb to open up both of these. Whipworm. Hit. Mm-hmm. And you. Alright, item room. Be good, be good, be good. I mean, that's... That's a bookworm. Does that do anything for us? Maybe it does. Oh, yeah. They sometimes shoot up four beams instead of three. It's too bad it's not six beams instead of three, but, you know, I guess I won't complain. That secret room up north? I think it might be. 
And they really want us to use that M item. They keep giving it to us like every run it feels like. Alright, we blow you up. I refuse to use it. We gotta see what's in the shop though. We got so much money. So tarot claw and a compass. So I, we can take both of these and we can roll them. I think the tarot cloth makes sense to take. Compass not so much. Car battery. So that doubles our book of shadows length, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, we will be taking that. Diploplia. Man, this is depths too. We have a full card. So I can deplop whatever the boss drops or the the special room. Hopefully we don't die. But if we survive, then I can do that. Yeah, let's go back and find some coins. <laughs> it's funny how I talk about not dying and immediately take a bunch of damage. Oh, all right. Guess I picked up a coin as I entered the room. Yeah, we already have a full card, so we can get out of the, the boss fight and go get our invincibility book again. Alright, mama. Let's play nice. Yeah, keep on top of these ads. I can pretty much one shot all the ads except for the uh, the goblins. Ooh, okay. So we didn't get a deal. That's unfortunate. Um, I think the Polaroid is where we go, right? Because that will always give us a shield for this first run. There's also a marked rock here. Okay, let's fool out of here and go get our invincibility book. We'll be back. We're not trying to go to the beast on this run, that's for sure. Um, Maybe there's something that we wanted to plop, I don't know. There's still secret and super secret rooms we haven't been in. There's a challenge room there. There might be something in there that we wanted to plop. Oh, this thing's still alive. If I had normal tears, I can kind of weave it in between these things, but these laser tears, they're like, nope. I don't want to waste a bomb on that. Okay, so I need to get rid of one more health. It looks like we have plenty of coins on the floor, so let's just touch this. Yes, we will deplop this. We'll be back. There should be another warp card on this floor, another marked skull, right? Well, not another one. There should be one marked skull. I don't think we've seen it so far. Let's go explore this room down here. Be very careful not to take any damage. There, yeah, that's where the skull is right here, actually. Okay, we'll be back for all of that. Okay, we grab these two things and we warp out. Oh, that's so much better on our tier rate. Oh my goodness. Okay.
Another mom item. I think that's the mom conversion now. Oof. All right. So how many coins do we have on the floor? Like, we can use a sack room. As long as we have coins. Come on, coins. Nice. A chest, more money, perfect. Well, we didn't get what we were looking for. I think that's all we do. If we don't get the angel room and we don't get the angel item, there's no point. Unless we want to fight the angels, there's no point doing anything else in there, I don't think. Okay. I kind of want to go into the cursed room. So many rooms to look at, so many things to do. I think we start collecting our money and then heading back towards the shop. See what else there was that we could buy with our 31 cents. And then we look at getting out of this floor. Thirty-seven cents. Whoop a key. Yeah, so many keys. Sixteen of them. Goodness. Okay, yeah, we want our invincibility book back. This is a wheel of fortune. I guess we can take that with us for now. Um let's leave and come back real quick. Get rid of that pedestal. Three cent bomb. Box of friends. Oh. Two trinkets is not bad. Doubles all blue fly spider spawn. All right. I mean, I guess that's fine. Blow this guy up. Maybe more money. Nope. Okay. Well, I mean, we got lots of stuff on this floor. Our tier rate is like fantastic compared to what it was. It's not as good as it could be, but it is great compared to what it was. Well, let's go. Let's just see what's in here. All right, we saw. Whoa, those guys are sucking. Okay, we've already taken one hit. We need, we need money. We need money fast. We need, oh, we need money so bad. Give me money. We need lots of money on the floor. I gotta use my invincibility book more often. That was kind of my fault for just like firing as soon as we entered that room and like letting those guys off their leash. Breaking the poos like that. I'll take the blame. It's, no, actually, you know what? It's your fault. It's not my fault at all. You watching the video right now, it's your fault. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Okay, let's just go ahead and do this then. Uh-huh. Okay, there's a marked rock here. I mean, that's a pretty good item. I don't think we need any more keys at the moment. Yeah, I think we'll go... Actually, we'll do this. We'll get rid of the, the fishtail. I think both of those are pretty good. Oh, brimstone spiders. Goodness. Yep. Oh, I just ran right into that. That was dumb. But we got two coins here to fill up my health, so it's all good. Mm-hmm. 
All good. Now it's not good. I should be able to place these down and then blow them up for a coin, right? Okay, Skull X. Uh huh. Show me that butt, Skull X. No, you're supposed to poke your butt out. Skull X, what are you doing? Fine, I'll just kill you that way, I guess. So, meat, I think? Does that actually give us more health? No. I don't want that. Alright, we grab our money. I think we're out of here. So the car battery mixed with a 4.5 volt and our tier rate, I think we're going to be fine against any boss that matters. It's just like the normal rooms we got to survive. But yeah, I think like once we fight a boss, like we'll just have infinite shield, so it'll be fine. This is another two keys, one bomb situation. Or you could do it with two bombs, I suppose, but I'm going to be frugal and we'll do it with one. Get over there, chest. Go on. Get over there. Okay, this is a moon card. Warp is good. Don't care about that, unfortunately. Whoa, fellas. Let's calm down just a little bit. Okay. Well, boss time. Yeah, I think we just fight Mom's Heart. It lives. We'll just put this up right away. Yeah, our shield is full and our book is ready. Or our shield's still going and our book is ready. Super greedy baby has appeared in the basement. All right, well, we're going up. Kind of wish I would have fought the angels now so I could get the key and fight Mega Satan because I think we just we just win by default with our current setup. Yeah, I, I don't see us not winning at this point. Unless I just take a bunch of stupid damage in a room, which, I mean, that can still happen. But against the boss, we're basically invincible. Nice. I refond, so that's just more flies. Very good. All right, upwards. Don't warp so close to me. What are you thinking? Two of clubs, more bombs. I like it. Let's do it. This thing. Don't crack the sky on me. What are you thinking? It's rude. Okay, no coins on this floor so far. Whoa, whoa! -ho. Okay, I'm gonna book here, because I don't trust anything else now. Moon. I was... I, I didn't trust it. That charges our book, alright. <sighs> that 
That's unfortunate. Let's try and be a little bit more careful here about taking damage. Magician would be good too. Do the large room. And we can't fight that thing. But we can't fight it, but <laughs> we'll never win. Okay, is everything done here? I think everything's done. Mm-hmm. Got a bomb. I think this can give us coins too sometimes. Yep. Awesome. Our health is full. I like it. I don't know if picking up five cents refills more than one heart container. I don't think we've test that yet. I don't think it does, but maybe it does. Oh! Oh, I ran into that little fire. I didn't even see it. Okay, let's go pick up that nickel then. Fill up our health. I mean, there's pots and stuff that we can blow up for more potential money for more health. There's lots of things that we can do still. Whoa. Eat these things. It's so annoying. <laughs> ah, all right. Very good. Isaac's head familiar with piercing tears. Don't care. All right. Well, we found the boss. That's the important thing. Which means we can get to the chest and potentially get stronger. All right. Let's just do this. Keeper versus Isaac. Okay, shield still going and our things recharged, so that is great. This right here might start depleting it though, because we can't keep constant attack on them. There is a little bit of downtime, but I think we'll still be fine. Oh, we're full. No, we're good. All right. To the chest. Keeper now holds wooden nickel. Ah, that's how you do it. Now I know. Um, I th think our lasers are already piercing, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, all these things are fine. There's nothing wrong with any of them. Except for Leo. Leo, I'm not really interested in. At least not right now. Maybe maybe I'll be interested in it at some point. But right now, I'm not interested in it. Oh, the horse got me. Money, please. No money. Dang it. I mean, I guess I should be using the shield in, like, these runes. Perthrow. Yeah, we'll roll this. Uh, a little girdy. Yeah. With all these low keys, my shield's definitely going to get recharged.
Hit this way. You're done. A lot of pills. Where's the money? Looking for money. Need the money. Yeah, there's just too many ads and things in this room. Yo, this guy's not even jumped once. What the heck? I like it when enemies just sit there and do like their charge up moves or whatever and then you just kill them before they actually do anything. Hey, there's some money. Mm-hmm. Well, there's nothing in here. Okay, well, our book's charged again in case we need it for war. The sun. All right, well, that'll show us the entire floor, and I think it will refill our health, too. I'm not sure if it works that way on this character. Don't burn something, bruh. HP up. So you can get one HP up on this character, then. Right? I don't know about these blood trails. I'm afraid. Was this one? Oh, it was a pill that I just picked up. That's a lot of crack to sky. Okay, our shield's ready again. Conquest should be about dead. There we go. Baby Plum! I haven't seen you in a minute, buddy. You used to be like real, real popular in Basement 1, and you kind of disappeared. Whoop. Alright. I don't think we've gotten a chest drop from anything, have we? You know, we got a luck uphill or a luck up lucky coin earlier, and now our luck is at zero. Did we start with minus one luck? Maybe we did. Maybe that's the deal. I'm just gonna use the book here. I don't trust this. Alright, I think that was a good call. Our book is fully recharged. Okay, well. There's some coins to go refill our health, and then we have the sun card, too. There's another coin up here. Oh no, our health is completely full. Does the counterfeit penny, when you pick up one coin and you get two coins, does it actually count for two health? Maybe it does. Alright, well let's go fight Blue Baby. Let's do this. Just need our book to charge once. There we go. Now we win. Let's get right up in his face. So all three beams, maybe four beams hit him depending on our procs. Ooh. 
We probably could have gone to the dark room, but I don't think we had this setup when we could have done that. I'm not actually sure. I don't remember. But anyway, our first run on the keeper. Success. Let's win. Deep Pockets has appeared in the basement. All right, guys, that is it for this episode of The Binding of Isaac Repentance. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the episode. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what I did wrong, what I could have done better, or if you have any tips or tricks for me on greed, or I'm sorry, not greed, keeper. <laughs> yeah, uh, let me know. But that's it. That's all I got for you for today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.